What's this? Bandages? What did you do? Um. Morning again. The simple answer is a favor. Not really a favor. A nice gesture? Sleep again? Um, relatively, I guess. I've For who? Morning out of you. Everyone? The unsorted? Does it hurt? Today's finally the big day. Well did. What? Is. Sorting. But you can move them. That's good. These are people that we're going to be fighting alongside. Spending our days with. I think it's a pretty good deal. We're fighting alongside all of them. Ow. We are. We'll be spending our time but with we'll be... majority of them. We'll be looking, working with them more closely. Than okay, I swear. That is fair. I'm getting food. It's a labor of love. I can't fix them, but I wish that I could. The thought is enough for me. You could bandage them if you'd like. No healing. Just bandaging. <laughs> Maybe you could have Talia look at them later. Sure. If you're okay with that. Just look at them, right? She could heal them. They wouldn't hurt anymore. Sure. But then that draws away attention from you that I could draw. <laughs> that would be a good thing that comes of this, too. A selfish indulgence of mine. Oh. Yeah, this is why I don't get up on my controllers. Fair enough. But no healing? No healing. No. <laughs>
Today's the ceremony, right? Yeah. Should we have our weapons on us? Do we need them for the sorting ceremony? I was just thinking, like, you know, they make it a little more official, but no, we don't need them. <sighs> I love my shield dearly, but if I don't have to carry it, then I'm not going to. Alrighty then. But that doesn't mean you can't carry yours. Sorry. Breakfast. Breakfast. Brecky boo. <laughs> you promised you'll come find me later to bandage your hands? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah, I am excited. <laughs> I'm glad. Hmm. I don't know if excited would be the word for you, but maybe anticipation? <clears throat> I'm not really sure how to feel. Relieved? Maybe. That it's the day of? That it's over with. Or that it will be. That you'll be there too. Wasn't it over with? Wouldn't it be over with the moment you received the invitation and accepted it? I still have the ceremony, Avi. It's not exactly something I'm looking forward to. But I'm glad it will be over. I don't really see the point of it all. I like the ceremony. You've never had, technically had a chance to be part of one, have you? Not like they started doing them, no. They called us all up one by one. Originally. Everyone was sorted together, I suppose. No one to stand around and watch, except for everyone else who didn't know where they would be. Good morning. You can see him. The early mor morning perch before he moves to the higher one. He's already there. <laughs> I swear he sleeps up there sometimes. <laughs> what? Oh. Wait, wait, who? Yoro. At least I think it's Yorl. I can't really tell. Morning. Hello. Mm, morning. Right. Yeah. You're, Good morning. Right. Yeah. Yes, called it. Morning. Mm. I'm day three. Yeah. Man, that guy has a lot of energy. What? <laughs> what? You know, for a second. And not a moment more. I thought there were two of you running around campus when he arrived. What do you mean two? I look nothing like him. You almost run the same. You almost look the same from a distance. And your personalities are similar. <laughs> Tell me I'm wrong. We're different. You're different up close. 
close. Go to the other side of the thing and then sit all the way up there away <laughs> from everybody. everybody. Uh, I guess I can take it. <laughs> he never he never stated how far he was going for a run though. That's no, true. No. That's true. <laughs> run to just, the other side of the room. You just go to the other side of the room to be alone over there. I like it up there. Hey, why not up there? It's nice up there. Yeah, mm. why, why not up there? I have to get to your own. That one's got more windows. Like That's bigger true. ones. Uh, huh? Good morning, Abby. Uh, really uh, good morning. Uh, I got a big uh, one in the middle. Hey, little guy, you okay down, down there? Alright. It's fine. It's fine. Ooh, okay. Well, fine. Did you? Okay. Just wanted to make sure. See, there you go. Now you can. You want some water down there? Hmm? Need some water down there? I have food in real life, and I'm gonna be making mungie noises, so you've been warned. And I hope you enjoy them. Okay, then. Hopefully, you enjoy your little people adventure. Hee <laughs> <laughs> hee. Food, food. It's sriracha, honey sriracha pork. Mm. I'm back with you. But I just dropped it on the floor. Son of a bitch. Yeah. Hey, give me one second. Oh, my fork too. You have a steak of your own. <laughs> you don't have to kill me over it. <laughs> sorry, sorry, no, it's just. Uh, I was being anxious for something. What did that chili? It's getting a little hard to breathe. Oh. I can open your nose if you want. As much as I. In a way. Prefer that. Please don't. This stage is so good. With how much you eat and how much you run, sometimes I'm surprised you don't get sick. What? You would think that me running would require someone to do you know. Mm. Yes, but <laughs> you shake yourself up when you run. Yeah. It helps the digestive system throwing all the digestive fluids around. You know. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh. 
Oh, a good ship. You ate that faster than I ate one. I'm impressed. Yeah, so, you like a good sort of way? Yeah. yeah. It's not a bad thing to have a good appetite. Uh, I had to be held back when we were on a shortage in, um, on, when we were on the island, you know? Mm. Yeah. Future teammate. Weird. Oh. I was just observing. Future vent arsenal. Does that one vent this though? Oh, I tackle Have you gotten a chance to speak with her? Yeah. I'll be not like by my lonesome, but you know. How is she? She seems kind enough. She gave me an antitoxin when I put, put my tongue on a frozen ice wall of hers. That was apparently a, an alchemical concoction. That doesn't really surprise me. I just thought it was a myth. <laughs> no, you know. So she does ice. Yeah. Um, a bunch of stuff. Shroud. Ex a tossed explosion. Hmm. A variety. Just like you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I don't think she's a healer, but I don't think you can heal with alchemical. Cal Alchemy! Mm. Oh, the Zuki! Watch that window. I'm sorry, though. Bad. You didn't do anything wrong. Just clean it when you're done. Then they have nothing to be mad at. I'm sure it'll probably take a while. I think I'll go do that. Be careful. 
Ah. We should talk to Ursa. Get up, up the window? Of your hands. Oh, right. You're not. You're not a servant. You're not a servant. I am trying to just be a good friend. I got it. Okay. If you say so. Hey, Talia. Hey, Lovey. Hey, Good Morning. Hope you're both faring well. <sighs> I'd say so. Could you enlighten me into when the ferality became so... Rude. Started when people started teaching them to swear. I guess Solace is no stranger to that then. <laughs> what? He literally cursed in front of one. <laughs> I said for all of you, they want to die. like sailors now. Wonderful. Most Just like, like anyone else, else though. That they, well, <laughs> I'd like to be here trying. They're not treated like servants anymore. Not really. Man, I thought I had a cool gimmick. Hmm. No, there's someone else I could fly to. That's fine. I know. Idea. Just wish they wouldn't be so crass. Sorry, we should uncross the door. Move out of the way. Yeah. They might just not know. I considered. You seem surprised. I haven't seen him in a few days. Give him Go on. What did he say? He likes it. He wants to like to put the hole in it. I think to put it uh, around the string or something. Then I'm sure he likes it. Um, any reason why you have your big old side? Any reason you have your big old uh, spear? <laughs> well, I mean, uh, it's, it's it's not out of the blue for me to, you know, have it on me, but like, I know I, this is the first time I'm seeing you with with it on at all since I've been here. I've been wearing it less than I once did. Maybe that's a bad idea. Hmm. What are you worried about? Alrighty then. Fair enough. And also, I think you're all joining teams today. I suppose that means I should dress up, right? That's what I thought too! For fuck's sake. At the same time! supposed thing. to be a captain or something. I did the After same all. exact thing! I knew it, I knew it! Everyone's I'm kind of it. being absurd. But, but I'm doing it too, so it's Some normal. Carrying weapons. I'd rather not carry the shield if I don't have to. You don't have to. <laughs> I can explain more later. Ominous. But it's not something you need to worry yourself about. A table for me. Table and bear it. Bear it. <laughs> foot drop. There's no door from way. behind the table. You were right. There's no need to be a crowd, everyone. <laughs> 
Okay, well, I'm gonna go for a run with my legs at work. Morning, Talia. Yeah. 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 Thank you for the killer. Yeah. What? I'm sorry? Oh, wait, hold on. Yes. I grab this thing real quick. Okay. Our speeches? Someone out here is still doing their homework. Mm, you don't assume that, that you would have to give a speech. No, actually. No. It is fairly normal for rituals. Yep. Are you okay? I would really have nothing to say. No, I, I don't want to say anything. Are you all <laughs> are going to be asked to give a speech? It's Xeon's life, it's The yeah, commander is going to be sorely mistaken. Morning, Matash. Uh, this never happened before, <laughs> otherwise I'd have warned mm. you as such. Can't be the only one not showing out. Besides, I'm sure there are many who doubt me. Because I didn't go to the previous. The least I could do is this. I'm not here to mess around. I'm not here to play games or play nice or be friends. <coughs> I don't care about any of that. But there is one good thing to come of this. I can stop leaving my shield in this tent. <sighs> Not that anyone is strong enough to carry. Just makes me significantly slower. able to go inside anywhere. <clears throat> Doors will be too narrow. He's fast. So fast I didn't even see him pass by. Hmm. Unless he took off.
Fancy bringing water to the Bronson. I thought they weren't servants anymore. I can't be the only one not putting out. I already didn't show up to their show and tell. You're silly, Sylvia. It doesn't seem silly. I won't be able to enter anywhere with this thing, though. Then I'll stand outside with you. Well, I'll help you adjust so you can walk in sideways. Well, lucky for us, it seems that your favorite people are outside anyway. Favorite people? Over there. I have, I have a lot of favorite people. Aqua, Ventus, Igginess. You are particularly fond of Ventus, though, aren't you? I suppose so, but, you know, they all have different reasons. The Aqua <laughs> Boys will always have a place in my heart. Unfortunately. Oh, that's Toyo! Hmm. morning Toriel. apologies Good morning. for leaving early um these two wanted to actually see the shield from up close ah i see curious little buggers that's Me. rude come on introduce yourselves what call them it's buggers they're mm. furally it's like me called it's like con almond almond Hello. that's so cute he does look like a little almond, mm -hmm. doesn't he? He does. I have to agree. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What about that one? And yourself? I like the quiet one. It's okay. What was that? Pocket. 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 They seem Pocket. to be obsessed with oh. those, so. Pocket. pocket and almond. I like those things. Good luck with the sword. It was almost gonna be pocket mm. and sand. <laughs> sand pocket. Almost was gonna be that, but it became almond. What? <laughs> we had no to something. More Hollywood, sorely. You like almond. Morning. Morning. Almond, almond is, is best. Better, I agree. Shall we? Mm -hmm. Shall we get? Yeah, we have to get going. Let's get this yeah. over with. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Meanwhile, eat your soup and bread together, you guys. Um, what? Oh no. Alright. How we do? I don't know. Okay, I mean, uh, like, I was already in the line if you want to oh, get over here. Oh, sorry. Here. I, I just. Uh, if you oh, want to. Uh, how are we doing this line? Are we. You guys in the back? Wow. I'm going to spot a few. I just got close to the boss. Really I mean, I, I can... Are we doing oh, a horizontal oh, line? Oh, yeah. 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 I'm going to... I'm going to get my... I'm going to get my... I need to say hello. It's like... I'm kind of... Beckoning you. She was waiting for you. She was waiting so long. She froze. It's finally time. Ah, gotcha. Are you lying if I said I wasn't excited? Yeah, sure. <laughs> Why are you behind me? Why are we backing up? What's up? Give me like 10 more of those. He wants us pretty far back. Let me... Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, further back. Yeah, we can't go backwards. There's a fucking wall. Uh, you want to? We gotta back up. Back up. Th 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 this is as far as we can go without crushing people. This is the far as we can go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, unless we make two separate lines. The salt radius. Once it's shaved for us. Winters. No oh, man. Now there's a okay, now there's a great wall behind. dividing us and sorted. Are we gonna be hit by it? <laughs> you won't be able to be seen. Can I get all the unsort over here? Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm being funded by the myself. Okay. We're going up front. Like the scribe for you. Just across the front. Excuse me. Um, come in as well. Um, do you mind if I grab something real quick for my tent to for the ceremony? <laughs> It'll be real quick, not even a minute. 
Yeah, they said a flowers bouquet. You have 30 seconds. 30 seconds! One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Six. Seven. You might eight, stop counting. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Oh my god, hi, Fourteen. Fourteen. His name's Percy. Sixteen. Seventeen. Is he gonna make it in thirty seconds? I really don't think you need to count. Twenty five. Twenty six. Long thirty. Thirty seconds exactly. Where'd you get those flowers? I found them. All right. What? That's what it is. Unsorted. If you could head into there, get changed. All of your new uniforms oh, are on fuck. the bench. Oh, fuck. And then once you're done, these just line up again. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. Rosewood. <laughs> I did not want to be here. But I want the future that is coming is even less. Look to Riker. Have you ever wondered what it will be like when the world dies? Because now you know. It will look like that. Those bodies still lying there. Staring up at a poisoned moon. Waiting for the ground to crack. Can be swallowed by void. I think. My words surprise you. They frighten you. Anger you. Oh, no, no, I think that one's mine. Because they won't lie. <laughs> Not to you, who have gone through so damn much to bring yourselves here. Oh. I've looked into your faces, and I've seen the cost you've paid. I've seen everything you've endured. Those bitter stories written in the shadows of your eyes. I'm supposed to ask you to give everything you have, even your lives, if it will hold the world together for another day, another second. But I can't. Looking good. You've all Keep this already in. done everything asked of you already. <laughs> You've suffered through so much. The fact that so many of you are still alive, that you're still here and willing to fight. I can't believe the courage of your witness. It must take for you all to face the world so fucking bravely. What right do I? Does anyone have to demand more? From you, who have endured horror beyond measure? Don't forget your shield. That's the thing, isn't it? I don't think I need to ask anything of you. We saw, right? Supposed to be there. That was uh, a heavy moment that will haunt many of us. But even in that ugliness, I saw hope. Not in the bodies littering the street, but in all of you. Working tirelessly. Many of you barely taking a moment to rest. I think in the future when I look back on all of this, it's going to be that moment I will point to as the moment I really did start to believe. 
I saw you stand. I saw you stand even when the cruelty of the world had beaten you down. I saw you stand even when the weight of despair and rage crashed down onto your shoulders. Most, important, most importantly, I saw you stand when the allies around you needed someone, anyone to be there for them so that they could stand too. You stand because you dare to hope. You have the fucking audacity to love this terrible, broken, and ugly world because I think you can still see the beauty in it. I have begun to see that beauty too. I found I'm still foolish enough to have hope. And before you, more fools to stand <laughs> as beacons of that hope. Fuck. In this doomed little circus that we call Rosewood. Yeah, we're kind of stupid. So welcome them as they don their new colors. Stand beside them as they face darkness. And show them love if they find themselves stumbling. Ventus, Captain, can you step forward? Oh, Jesus fucking Christ. Please. I don't want to be first. I want to be here. <laughs> oh, fuck. Avilio. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Ventus and its captain, trusting them with your life as you confront Thrifts? Aye. Do you accept this soldier? Gladly. Join your team. Welcome. Thank you. So are there. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Ventus and its captain, trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts? I do. And Captain, do you accept this soldier? Certainly. Welcome. Please join your team. Jacqueline. <laughs> Jacqueline, do you swear your life to be captain? This one. Trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts. Thank you. Captain? Team Ventus is whole. Terra Captain. Jacqueline. <laughs> as whole as it can be, I suppose. Go on this way. It's needed today, sir. <laughs> oh. At least for now, with the shield. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Terra <laughs> and its captain, trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts? I do. Captain, do you accept this soldier? Of course. Please join your team. Isaiah. Welcome. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Terra and its captain, trusting them with your life as you confront the rest? Thank you. As for there is hope for this world, I do. And do you accept this soldier? Absolutely. And your team. This all feels so pointless. Terra is whole. Oh. 
Umbra Captain. It's just words. Riley and Percy. It's just honeyed words. And Percy. Riley, Percy, do you both swear your loyalty to Team Umbra and its captain, trusting them with your life as you confront the rift? What does it matter? I do. I'm going to take this one. Do you accept these soldiers? It doesn't. Yes, sir. Who cares if they accept us or not? What and difference does it make, well? aside from the fact that we are here to do the same job? Who cares? I don't care. Lumen Captain. I don't get it. I don't care. Helma. Lost another one, did you, Captain? Helma. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Lumen and its captain? Trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts? Yes. And Captain, do you accept this soldier? Of course. And I hope we are welcome. Pleasure. Please. Join your team. <laughs> oh, poor Tickle. Pretty Aqua, Captain. Run, Tickle, run. You're almost through. Sliding with style. <laughs> Thank you. Do you swear your loyalty to Team Aqua and its captain? Trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts? Everyone looks so good in their colors, though. Like, out of character for a second. I'm like, holy shit, everyone looks great. Captain, do you accept this soldier? <sighs> Quit looking at me. Please join your team. Quit looking at him, too. Let him hand out his doofy little flowers. They're really cute. Looks like we're missing one. Winter. You swear your loyalty to Team Aqua and its captain. <laughs> Trusting with your life as you confront the rifts? And do you accept this soldier? Then please, join your team. Captain of Ignis. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. She's so you fucking swear cute. Loyalty to Team Ignis and Captain, trusting them with your life as you confront the rifts. Two completely different dragon again. Captain, do you accept this soldier? Um, made aware you have a speech. I did not have a speech. I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> then please, Gave join your team. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, of course. Cat. Cat. Your well. teams are filled. No, it was struggling. It's time take your first steps boldly into legend to stand amongst what might someday soon be the bearers of a new age stand beside them so that they can stand beside you and show the world what they have shown me <laughs> that even if the end has come that we are not afraid we're gonna shut ourselves oh we're not afraid <laughs> mm. Or they're super unimpressed. I'm sorry. Awesome. That was really good, Kaslin. Get me the fuck out of here. That's what she would say. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> sir. Okay, 
I have a request. <laughs> we get bunks now, right? I'd like to put this in the ship. Uh, I also would like to know where my stuff is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You That's an impressive shield. Thank you. She's so cute. My joy. Do you want to run? <laughs> I, I, I'm doing. I think I'm doing an expert job at it as it is. <laughs> she wants to take the dog for walkies. <laughs> Oh, and you're so cute. <laughs> Thank you, Yurichi. Thank you for the worries, Alvin. I appreciate it. Of course. I got it for everybody. Okay, what, what happened? Avi handed out roses to all the new, newly sorted. Oh, that is cute. <laughs> I just wanted to make it more of a ceremony. It was quite a ceremony. As would as well. Left Yuki behind. Oh, no, Talia's trailing behind her. <laughs> I guess bunking situation is something to discuss too. Like who's gonna be sleeping in what bed? Mm, true. That's true. Usually uh, Talia, Yuki, and I sleep in uh, one room together. <laughs> ah. So we have that first, if you're gonna have to sort it out with between you three. I'm pretty sure that yeah, can sort it out because there's only three <laughs> bedrooms. Three beds, three okay. beds, beds three in one beds. room. Mm. Okay. Yeah. This is to the Ventus room on the left, which Avi and Sorolair have, I think, already occupied at some point. It's almost as if you had manifest destiny. <laughs> or I like hey. my friends. One of the two. Mm -hmm. I'll be honest, I have no idea what that means. <laughs> it means that, um, that you do something in order to make something happen. Like, it's supposed to be prophetic, but in reality, you made it happen. <laughs> I see. Yeah, I can't make that jump from going around. <laughs> I think most of us I can't make that jump. I learned that lesson in a very far thing way when being chased by a couple of titans. Truly. 
Sounds like a hard lesson to learn. We've had harder. Hmm. Is Yuki staying behind? Meet her in a moment. She wants to bide her time with mine. Eleni is so fucking cute. She's secretly a puppy too. I didn't like this airship. <laughs> At least it's not up in the air. Yeah. Mm, sort of it is. Sort of is, but not too high. What pets do you guys want to call, huh? I don't have a preference. Neither do I. Ah. Uh. <laughs> what bed would you Maybe like, Aldi? Because I feel like I, I'm, I'm the only one who's so enthusiastic about it. I feel like I'm left out. <laughs> I'm enthusiastic, just I don't express in the same way that you do. Um, I, 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 as a child, I've always wanted a top bunk. Have a bunk Not bed and have the top one. <laughs> is that is it really okay? Like no taxi backsies. It's more than okay. No taxi backsies. You you promise. The, the, the moment I, I I step on it, there's no take backs. Pinky swear. <laughs> ah, ah. Careful. Watch your stuck. head in the spear. Yeah. Uh. You might want to take off your spear and shield first. If you don't have a preference, then I'll take this one. <laughs> More than fine with me. <laughs> That's the furthest one. It's easier for me to store my shield. Okay. It's great. Uh, it also has storage uh, and I can uh, hide uh, things in it. Okay, it's Careful. probably the best thing that I actually got this <laughs> one. Possibly. Uh. <laughs> it suits you. What? The bat sound buck? <sighs> Who gets which bed? Mm, I would not be surprised. Pretty much. <laughs> Are you all settled? They've relinquished that right. That great honor. 
You don't <laughs> have the shorter ones, but it's easier for you to get up there. It's still mine. <laughs> I mean, he's what, it is his. almost as tall as you. So we're on and the left. I can remember left. Oh, he knocked his spear while getting up there already, so there's a dent in the roof. <laughs> I almost got stuck. He did. Please be careful. Let's go outside. If you don't like it in here, we can find a place. Excuse me, a place that's nicer. Hi. Not as tall. I'd like to speak with you all for at least a few minutes, but I won't I'm take tall? too much of your time if I can avoid it. <laughs> Very well. You're t you're tall. You're taller than me. I can't see the top of your head. Let's go. Anyway, let's go. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm tall. I'm tall. You are growing. Was I shorter before? I can't remember. It's been so long. I'd say so. Yes. What a gentleman. I don't like that she's always behind us. Oh, we're going into the secret. Oh no, wait, I thought that was. They were going to the super secret ice cabin where I found those crystals. Sit or stand as it pleases you. It makes no difference. Okay. Yeah, something real quick. I think you'll take less than thirty seconds this time. We <laughs> almost had it before. Last time. Thirty-five. I found a crystal. Yeah. There's a decent number of smaller ones. You can carve them quite easily if you wish. If you don't have tools for it, I can lend you some. I don't know what I'm making out of. <laughs> if not, see, like in the back of like the stall where it works too. In any case, first of all, welcome, our three newcomers. Mm. I am not one for speeches or activities or. In candor, leading. I'm still relatively new at it, in terms of what matters. So... I'll focus first on what I need everyone to know. And then I'd like to talk with any who wish to get to know a little bit about more of you, but... Nobody's going to have to stay for that if you don't want. You all, well, the three of you just swore an oath in loyalty to team and captain. I don't expect your undying loyalty to me. If we're in combat and I make a decision, I ask that you make that choice if you're able. But I also ask that each of you tell me if I'm wrong. Tell me if you disagree with what I'm doing. I'm captain because it's what, at present, was the best option. If you all decide 
that I'm not who you think will best lead you. That's your choice to make. If there are problems, we'll fix them. And if you'd rather someone else wear the cape, so be it. If anyone does have those thoughts, feel free to take it up amongst yourselves. Mm -hmm. In terms of what I need everyone to know. Should you require anything, or should my assistance be of use, it is always available to you. Should you wish my time, ask for it. I trust you all to do what you feel is right in most situations. And I don't think your soldiers to be ordered around. I'm not going to give you idle errands simply to train your obedience. I don't care about that. And I don't think any of you do either. I'd like to start, since I think that the three of you might not know as much about what we can do as we might know about what you can do. Though I'll admit, Sorely, I yet have no idea what you actually have in terms of stuff aside from your shield. Mm. But then, I don't. <laughs> Always ready to talk to you about that. Oops. It doesn't matter to me, but that's neither Sorry. here nor there. <laughs> if we're going to operate as a team, we need to know what we each bring to the table. I have a great deal of healing magic. I can offer stamina, should yours be lacking. Something akin to a stamina potion of sorts. I can offer it to the group, so don't feel afraid of asking for it. Otherwise, I, I can heal at the first, second, and third circle. I have a shroud spell as well. It allows me to... Uh, well, it's third circle. It allows me to take a decent amount of the beating, which makes up for... <sighs> You're all fucking tall. This is unfair. <laughs> I'm not. Doesn't... Would you like Anyways. us to sit? <laughs> no. I, like I said, do as you wish. I'm sorry, I'm bad at this. I have a sword, I can summon one of ice. My left arm's pretty useless, so I don't carry a shield. When I figure out how to get that fixed, I'll probably match Yuki in terms of outfit. Though, I've never been much, much for uh, shield use. You may not have to. Not with me around. Elenia, could you let everyone know what you do? The offensive ways I have uh, two knives that uh, can make into swords and uh, healing first, uh, sort of second, and uh, the third uh, circle. Mm. Oh, and uh, if there is, uh, I can. Uh, uh, look at the uh, your um, mm, uh, pathways. Mm. If there is something wrong in there, and uh, oh, I know how to uh, over the time uh, heal uh, blocked uh, well with uh, some others and the medical uh, uh, people. And uh, what else can I do? Oh, if there is an active uh, spell uh, on you, like uh, let's say Talia's. Uh, what is it again? Shroud. Your shroud. If it is on and she cannot take it down for whatever reason, I can go up to her and uh, help her uh, remove uh, the spell from her. Is that everything? I think so. Mm. You can come back to it later if it isn't. Mm. Well, 
I'm an alchemist. I can do first circle equivalency of potions to all the way to third circle. My first circle allows me to light my sword and fire and affect rift beasts in the magical sense. My second circle equivalency of potions is stuck in the mud, which when thrown slows down opponents in a small area. And I have a nice wall. My third circle equivalency of potions includes that of a third circle straddle, similar to Talia's, I suspect. And an explosive potion, which I like to call Firebomb. Which I'm able to throw and impact she quite doesn't a few use magic. enemies in a given area. My greatest weakness is that I cannot cast. <laughs> You're all my teammates now, and I feel safe enough and feel as if I must share this. My wells are blocked. I cannot use aid for tech. I cannot use magic at all. Good. That's all. Well, I do Good. mostly magic. I summon my sword and my shield. I can also, those are ice. I can also summon my fire sword. Those are first circle. And my second circles are spikes coming out to the ground and a fire storm kind of protects and also damage those around. I had healing, but it's not, I can't summon it, but I'm trying to learn it again. I am mostly a prince when I battle the Rift Beasts. That's what I do. Um, similar to Yuki, I can summon an ice weapon. It is only first circle, but that's all it needs to be. For second circle, I have a knockback. And a shroud. Otherwise, I can take a lot of hits. Hi. Go ahead, Alvin. Um, <laughs> you so cute. I saw it all, but like, I have, first, I have first circle and second circle healing, single target. Um, I also have some uh, long range capabilities as a first circle spell. It's real slow, but I can move it around. Um, for second circle, I have uh, the cone spell. It, it's, uh, it attacks whatever's in front of me. Um, I'm not too meaty, but I have a, a first circle shroud. It helps with some resilience. As well as, uh, I suppose you should all know it. it um, I... I'm able to cast a first circle occultic spell. Um, it takes really long for me to get into that mindset, so if you are kind of allowing me to do something like that, um, it, it'll take a minute or two and, um, to get into that headspace. Um, Sorry, it's... Perfectly alright. Nothing to fe yeah. feel shame yeah. about. Okay. Thank you. I... I my shroud is also works as a foci. Both my shield and spear. Although, the unique thing I can do with my shield, um... I can cast a wider portable shield with it. And be mobile with it. Just about the size of my body. It's second circle though, so it's a bit costly. But if you need me to be a frontliner with that, then I would be willing to um, give them out of it. I, I think that's all. I'm also kind of fast.
Ventus has trained in the past with formations and stances and front lines and, well, playing soldier. I've rarely found that it matters when things get messy. And Rift Beasts don't fight like soldiers. Mm, In general, no. the reason that I asked everyone to share is because my hope is that you're all smart enough to know where you need to be in a fight. And you now know what everyone else around you brings to the table and what they're going to be doing too. Does anyone have a question about where their place is? I've always known where my place was. It's okay to have them. I don't ask meaninglessly. Okay. Well, then let me state my understanding of it, in case I've made any errors. Elenia and I are certainly our weakest fighters. I lack the defensive options and well, as brilliant as you are with your knives, they're not even a meter long, and, well, you get hit a lot. They do. For the most part, the two of us can handle healing, as well as supportive things. If there are stragglers around, we'll try to deal with them. Me and there's Woody. You and Eleni are probably better at that than me. You're both faster than me now. <laughs> Jacqueline, Sorlier, and Avi, you're insofar as we'll have a front line, probably going to be it. I don't know how much in terms of reagents you need to go into battle. From the amount of potions you're wearing, I assume you are pretty versatile with what you can mix. Hmm. I am. I can provide my strong mm -hmm. ingredients and reagents for myself. In that case, I'll try to focus some... Go on, please. I'm also able to take and make simple healing potions, mana potions, stamina potions, anything that is needed. <sighs> Well, if history is anything to go by, I'm guessing we'll use the mana potions quite frequently, though a lot of us carry them into battle as it is. For my part, I'll try to conserve my mana and use it less on my shrouds when I don't need to, as well as on my, we on my weapon when I don't need to, and instead focus on healing. That'll give you more leeway to do what you need to do, and Elenia can be my second on that. Avi, feel free to heal whatever comes up, but don't feel like you have to overextend yourself to higher circles. Best to save your mana for the things you're good at. We've got you covered. Okay. And Sorlier, it's going to be honestly very pleasant to have someone that's good on the front again. <laughs> I'm glad. It's been a while. In case any of you don't know, <coughs> Ventus got to where we have three openings because we lost two of our members and a third left. Ulysses died of an aetherite illness. He's buried up the hill there. Mm, nice meeting spot. Tau was taken from us some months ago now. We don't know where. We think he was taken by the setting sun. But we don't know that for sure either. And I've had no leads when I've looked. <sighs> Do not know. Kiki decided to leave us. Things were bad for her after Ulysses and after Tao and after everything, and Emma needed her. Ventus was once a family. Not going to expect that we're that now. 
You three don't know us very well. And that's okay. And it's not the only factor. I'm not interested in what I had. I'll tell you all this as well. Winter was once a member of Palvindor. What? He was with them in Bessin. As she says, she was pressed into service against her will. And they even now hold her sister. She's told me that she's here to fight the rift. She believes in our mission, that she's no risk to those here. For my part, I believe her, at least so far. I don't trust her implicitly. I'm not a fool. But I know a little bit about what it's like to be forced to do things you don't want to do by people that can make you. I'll not ask any of you to extend that same offer. But I've given her my aid. If you all disagree with that, we can talk about it. But should she come to you, it's your choice how to help her or not. You'll all also certainly be aware that I'm in a relationship with Lothario. I love him a great deal. Were I to choose between my place here and him, I would just have Please don't die. <laughs> I think she's a little speechless. Mm -hmm. I suppose we could take a moment. Mm -hmm. the, Is there anything that any of us want to talk about? She's really a Alvin Dian. <laughs> She's been uh, pretty open about it with us. But, uh, Hard for you. Kind of, yeah. Mm. I'm if we uh, said that I'm you don't have to do anything or interact with her if you don't want to, it is your choice. You did not know her, and she does not know you. But uh, you, you can. Uh, Choose, uh, what they it's want just, to do. it's just hard, kind of hard to believe how she was so nice to me as all. Well. I'd like to talk to you on the topic more, Avi, between just the two of us. But there will be time for that. Okay. Apologies. Um. Uh, 
I've lost my place. It's not important, I'm sure. But If you had to choose between your place here and Lothariel, you would choose Lothariel is where you left off. I would. But while I wear the cape, my obligation is first to you all. If I'm not sleeping in my bunk, I'm likely with him. Should you need me, you can come get me. And should you think that my relationship gets in the way, tell me. Doesn't matter. You would choose him anyway. <laughs> I'm sure I have many other flaws. I'm often emotional. Decisive in the moment, but... But I won't fuss about loyalty when I would do the same for Avi. That's what I bring to offer. I'll not ask any of you to stay any longer, unless you have questions that you think everyone should hear. I'd like to get to know some of you better, but there'll be time enough for that individually, if you'd rather not stay. I if you'd like to go, to be. feel free to be about your day. Otherwise, if there are any that do wish to stay, I'm happy to keep talking for a while at least. Oh, and also, uh, I'm probably a bit obvious, I'm not uh, good at the whole uh, lieutenant uh, thing, but I'll do my best. Uh, if you get mad at me, let me know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll try not to uh, do the thing that uh, made you mad again. Uh, but uh, if you can't uh, find her, uh, you can... And uh, talk to me if you want to. If not, that is fine. You sit down. Yeah. I'll admit, I know I've spoken with at least a few of you on these things, but are I you have going had to sit or are you going to leave? Conversations in the last week, and I can't remember who I've told what. So here's who I am. My name is Talia. I'm from a clan known as Magnus in the north. I don't recall. I must not be on my side. That's unfortunate. Do you have anything you'd like to share, Elenia, about yourself as a lieutenant? My name is Elenia. I don't really I'm have a last name. I'm gonna go. Uh, uh, oh, there goes mm. Yuki. Thought so. I'm Brozen. I come from the market area in the southern Broza. Mm. I used to be a slave. Yeah, not a slave anymore. Now I'm here as a lieutenant on a team. It is a big jump. Uh, I am a half elf. Mm, so if that is a problem for any of you, let me know. Mm. Okay, you good? Okay. 
How do you operate as a lieutenant? You've not been lieutenant very long. But normally I talk to Sally about a lot of things and I make uh, plans with her and uh, we share our ideas and uh, disagree or agree on things. Mm. Do you disagree often? Uh, no, not too often, but uh, it does happen. Mm. Mm, I think it has only happened uh, once? Maybe twice? But uh, normally our uh, thoughts on things align. Uh, sometimes they don't and then uh, we talk about it. Uh. Mm. Normally in a fight, uh, we will keep an eye on everybody and make sure that everybody is not uh, hurt mm, and not uh, running off. Mm. I think that is what the lieutenant does. Hello. What is it that you do? She asked uh, what I do as a lieutenant. So, uh, I talk to you, talk and to you, we agree and disagree, and. Uh, mm. Alenia is invaluable to me. I ask her for advice frequently. She's able to be places that I'm not. Tells me if I'm being stupid. Mm. And you she's a reliable that. second. I suspect I will quite often be stupid now and in the future. Mm. I hope it doesn't inconvenience you all too much. Look who you're talking to. Happy to have you, Abby. Truly. Good answers. Who I am is, well, I was a writer. I killed people. We killed people. We took their stuff. I was never educated, not properly. I learned to read here, I learned to write here. I was apprentice, I suppose, to our healer. My strange manners of speaking are hers. I'm not a soldier, I've never been. I'm not going to start now, I think it's stupid. But it's okay, though, because if we just keep putting up off walls, they'll keep out the rift beasts this time, right? I just had a thought about that a couple of days ago. <laughs> no. No. Stone cages. Before. You think everything should be very open. Mm. Defenses are good. Sometimes. Look how well the <coughs> improvised wall did in Kenvale. It didn't. It was good to hide the behind, at least. Anyways. 
That's who I am. <laughs> this doesn't have to be a going around thing, but oh, no, I wanted I you all to know. Over there. No, I. Because she's on like my right, and I can't really see her. So you know, I just want to like <laughs> see everybody. Do you want me to shuffle around yeah. to the other two? Yeah, so you're able to see in general. Do you prefer this life to your last? No. What? She said the. Uh, what did you say? I already forgot. Do you prefer this life to your last? I know that you do. But do you? Oh, I thought you said you prefer us if we lied to your left. <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> they, yes, they do prefer this. Oh. <laughs> I am too forced to kill things that I do not want to and uh, do things that I don't want to for them. So, yes, I prefer it. And I can actually talk to people. That is nice. I have gone. For my part. Yes. I prefer it here. There are many problems here. <coughs> They're not perfect, certainly. But most days I get to help people, or at least work towards it. I'm not just stuck. Where the only help I can offer is when I can sneak past someone else to do it. There are parts of me that miss the North. Parts of me that miss the fighting. I'm not very proud of those parts of me. But they're there. They're your stronger parts. I miss the snow. I miss the cold. I don't miss my clan. There is little in this world that I like less than my surname. And all that it stands for. I hope that answers the question. Hmm. You two were here previously. Did you prefer the life at Rosewood compared to your past? I suppose so. It was better in some ways, I suppose. What do you miss most while you're here, Bobby? I miss my dad. I miss my home. I miss the thick green forests with many abundant colors. He misses his mother. Mm. 
Yep. I'm trying to find Where? the spots to go in. Go on. No. Sorry. Where is home? I'm not sure. Home is where the heart is. Plains. A favela. My home wasn't much, but it was home. Shack in the middle of nowhere. But it's yours. Hmm. And your father, he's there now. No. Um, a rift beast came and tore it apart. Me and him managed to escape because of uh, the help of a paladin that was walking on by. Really incredible mage. He took us to the sweating pole for the remainder of there. That's where I trained. She trained me. Where you learned your divine magic? Yeah, well, at least the beginning crops of it. Don't ask me a question right now, I'm getting lemonade. I haven't told anyone this, but I feel as though it's appropriate. That same paladin is a Kakarian. She was a prime to be. I don't really I'm, know what that means. Um. The Primes of Favera. Huh? Is that? Should we go on? <coughs> yeah, that. that looks safe. It looks like a moth. Worse. Hey, Avi. Hi. Think you can hit him from here? Give me one second. He's less out of aim. You want me to? I could assist. <laughs> oh, he's gone. Never mind. I'll get him next time. Alright, uh, excuse me, I have balls to find. Good luck. Balls of yarn. <sighs> oh, that's good, that's good. Oh, that's good. I could just turn your head away. Mm -hmm. I thought we were under attack for a minute. Me too. I didn't recognize his jacket. I thought it was Rift Beast because of the thorn or the thorny looking thing. Oh, that's my lemonade. You can do what you want to choose. Yeah. It didn't look like cheese. I just kicked my lemonade. Two hours, random spot on the ground. I can hit him now. He's out in the open. I'd rather you didn't. Lothario's gone. Is it us for Rafa? Yeah, but the good thing helps some others as well. There's nothing wrong Having with asking for a little help. Having good relations has its benefits. In moderation. Yeah.
And where in the north do you head? We were northwest. But we spider webbed into smaller tribes that wandered. Nomadic for the most part. Except for the hub. Oh, you were looking at me, I thought. I can't look at you? I... just... it seemed as though there might eyes. be something. You don't... <coughs> you don't have to close your eyes, Ollie. Okay. Where I'm from? Is that what you wish to know? Or? Sure. Vivira. Originally Greenhaven, but after it fell, everywhere. Moved around Greeny. Moved around Fevera a lot. Specifically in the north. Green Heaven's the north and west, right? Mm. It's yes. It fell some time ago. It'd be about six years ago or seven. That when you were blocked. Were no. you fighting? No. Before then. When I was nine, I was blocked. I never got to cast my ever get get to cast my first spell. <laughs> so it's quite hard to miss. Perhaps you're lucky in a sense, then. Agreed. It's quite yeah. miserable. I don't know if you yeah, experience okay. it the same way. Questions for you both? In what sense? What's up? Uh, anything announcement-wise that I need to be aware of coming in? Mm, nope. Right. When I reach out Thank into the world, mm -hmm. I can feel oh, the magic. Actually, also, do you need any help with anything, or I can I grab just it, come in I can touch it. I nope, I think we're good to go. It shift and Got it. pull it from the air and move it myself. It's like feeling the wind on your skin. It's just part of how you experience the world. When I was blocked, I could still sense that which is there. Not as strongly, but I couldn't reach out and touch it. It was like there was something in the way. And it made it harder to reach for those things as well. It truly sounds miserable. I don't feel that way at all. I guess it's hard to miss what you never really had. Mayhaps. Or mayhaps it's an individual experience. Hmm. I don't regret the actions that got me blocked, though. I'd do them again. I'm glad you had a choice in the matter. I'm sorry you didn't.
It's the past. You're a great many things are the past doesn't mean we need to be glad for them. It is at least the good thing that uh, now we know how to fix it if that ever happens again. True. It's good that we learned before Malik was killed. We've really had a bad run with leaders of the initiative lately. I say lately, it's ever since I've joined, really. It sounds like it. I heard your chance to be killed think? by one of the students. Yes. Morgan. She killed him in the cave there. One last dragon can. He claims Plus something got in their hands and forced them to fight. Most here disbelieve that. Jackson doesn't seem to believe it. Not from how it's told. Do you? I think that there are orbs of light that invade our dreams, that cause us to see things, that have a stated goal of affecting our decision, our actions, our choice. I think that people wake up in places that they didn't go to sleep and don't know how they got there. And I've seen what it can do to change people, to influence them. I've seen what it did to people that I cared about. I don't know. But I think to imagine that our Chancellor is murdered. And that then an orb of light appears that attempts to change our us. Meanwhile, our replacement leader is weak willed and incompetent. I think that those who see coincidence in these things are Well, maybe I'm simply paranoid. But I could be paranoid and wrong and have it be better than being cautious and dead. I think Morgan was probably affected. Maybe I'm wrong. She'll have a hard time running away from guilt. I'm not sure if you ever do. I haven't. To kill someone is one thing, to murder them is another. Who's going to speak first? Who's going to do it? What's to miss about the desert? <clears throat> Not too much, but I guess I prefer the warm weather. Is this not warm? Yeah. 
This is cool. And this is the the very cold day. Really? And all the nights uh, get uh, very cold. Mm. Lots uh, colder than this. I guess it can be, it's kind of like a, when the sun is going down. But uh, mm. I suppose I miss uh, walking through the sun. Even now I'm sweating beneath my canvas and I hope we never go to the desert. I'm sorry. I know you'd like the warmth. I'd rather not uh, go back either. I'm getting used to something's uh, wrong. Cold, I think. You're going to like uh, probably be a puddle on the ground if you go to the desert. Sweat. You'd probably freeze in Jaza then. You were there, right? Yeah. I don't like snow. <laughs> it can be pretty when it's not trying to kill you. the snow the most. Hmm? It is very bright. Like when the sun mm -hmm. on it, it gets in like you the the Whoa. Right. And also when it is snowing and the snow gets in my eye. I don't like it. You get used to it. enough. If you wear enough wrapped around your head it shades your eyes. Some wear a very, very thin cloth over. Mm. It is also what you do in Rosa, you wrap your whole face. So that the sun does not uh, beat it down on you too much. You would is think that not that miserably warm? Desert, you would think it would be miserable, but when you're going through the desert, you don't want to like, wear nothing. You want to like have very light uh, clothing all over you, so that uh, the sun does not uh, bore it down on you, and you keep your body shaded. <sighs> oh no. Mm. Maybe it was a poor uh -oh. location. She returns, we can shift to another place if we'd like to continue this conversation. Mm. It is also not good if you have a lot of scars all over your snow. Those make you it a lot sweat. harder to get to mm. make sure you take care of like a large uh, scars by your body. Make sure that you know where each oasis is. Hello. Hmm? Oh, that's really... Hello. Well, also, you know what to look out for when you go to an oasis. Was Lucifer ever sent out? There are a lot of the creatures that go to there Yeah, too. he's out. Oh, hell yeah. He's been out for a while, since the end of the, the meeting. So you got to be careful. 
Huh. Dangerous and creatures as fearsome as they say. Mm, from every time I've told the people what the I know about and what I have personally come across, and they all look at me like there's a look of horror on their face. <laughs> Like the on the oasis, one of the ones that you really want to look out for are uh, the ones that hide under the ground, and they have a little a uh, bright uh, flower or uh, something like a uh, food on top, like attached to uh, one of their uh, legs. And uh, if you touch it, they like come out of the ground, and they have like a little door thing that they make and then they come out and they grab you and then they pull you down. Wow. That's like a it's real hunting nice trap. pit, but alive. <laughs> you want to look out for the brightly colored things in Brazil. Those are bad. Bright colors do tend to mean danger. Danger. Oh, poison. That's why when uh, the flowers first uh, started to bloom here, I freaked out. <laughs> I thought they were poisonous or something. Mm. What do you two miss about the north? Who's you two? <laughs> Those two? No, yourself and Soralia. She already say so. Fair enough. The snow, the glimmering frost, Luminaria. I don't really. Oh, come on. This... You don't even miss the war claws? Mm. I suppose sometimes. If they could kill riff beasts, I'd suggest we go tame a pack, but I don't think they're any good for it. No. They're really aggressive. <laughs> but they're cute. But... A large cat. They can teleport from place to place in small jumps. You can ride them. Some of the... Dang, sure. Yeah. Some, some of them Does end up just looking like... Cats? Yeah, they move so quick. Some think? of them are incredibly lethal. And some of them look like giant house cats. That's how deceptively cute they are. <laughs> Have you seen the scars on my leg? From a work law. We used them to get from place to One place. Swipe. We tamed them, we bred them. We used them to travel, we used them to fight. No, it could always tell a strong tribe from a weak one if they had any. They're a lot of work. But they're good. Hello. Uh, excuse me. Hi. Hello. Hello. Sorry? Uh, are you getting into something? I don't want to interrupt. Not particularly. I don't mind if you join. 
amongst the others too. Um, okay, we just need to talk to Jacqueline for a little bit. Um, we're putting together a list of supplies, and we wanted to talk to someone from the uh, Alchemy Division for any supplies for either the greenhouse stuff or alchemy supplies that we might need to pick up before we start our heading out. Mm. I'm technically not a part of the Alchemy Division as of yet. Oh, okay. Well, uh, I'd recommend uh, you talk the to Ren. Professor Rin, suggested but... we talk to you. Ren seems like they're going to be free. Mm. Sure, I can spare some time. Oh, excuse me for a second. Take as long as you wish. He's so cute. He's just sitting. Riding a monkey. Hey. You two are in Droza before here, right? Mm hmm? Can I ask what happened? Really? I'm sorry. Want me to say? I can't remember half of it. <sighs> this it's sort of egged on Surlia to perhaps we can go see her tribe and such maybe I was foolishly optimistic saying they'd finally let her back after so many years and getting stronger you know although she had some Some reasons to go back as well. We weren't welcome back, that's for sure. I tried to fend off Sorlia, and they tried to take me in Toriel. So I was fit to be servants. Slaves. That's how she. <laughs> That's how she got that. That's kind of what drove me to be an occultist as well. As I said before, there's no shame in it. There's plenty of shame in all of it. All of us. Except for you, by some miracle. I'm sure that all of us here have done things that we had to do to survive, Avi. Or that we thought we had to, even.
I'll warn you three as well, since it seems fair. I fled from my clan after murdering two of them. I'd not be welcomed back, and it's not unlikely they might attempt to make of those close to me what they would have made you and Toriel. The two that I killed were not good people, but I ended their lives selfishly. If there's a burden to be paid for that, if it ever come to it, I'll pay it myself. But I'm sorry if it causes any of you grief. I think we can agree that Droz is a shit place. Not worth saving. Doesn't deserve saving. Can rot in the hole it dug for itself. This conversation got much darker than I initially imagined it might be. <laughs> Pasts are a grim thing in this world. I assume we all came to Rosewood to make it better. Because we realized that. The world was unjust. It was painful. That why you came? I came for my family. For my sisters, so they can have a better tomorrow. I wish for a world where they don't have to learn to use a sword. To cut down their fellow man. I fight for them, and the other young ones like them next generation. They deserve a better tomorrow. A noble goal? <laughs> Perhaps. I think we are similar in that case. Who do you fight for? <laughs> I suppose Toriel is getting up there. But generally... Wanting to leave something in its place. Making this world better than when I was given it. At the very least. Hmm. With or without Rosa.
And if Avi's not in it, then... What is your goal, Without Avi? me, too. In being at Risewood, do you fight for anyone? In a way, yes. But... As silly as it sounds, I've always wanted to be a hero. Though, so, I know stuff, something like that is uh, a bit delusional. So, in a way, I want to be a hero that is best fit for this world that we live in. Whatever that looks like. It may not be what I imagined it to be. I still don't know what it could look like. But I'm still aiming for it. Just like when I was saved, I want to be... That sort of person. Because when I needed most, it came to me. We have a next slave. And the next raider. I also want to make my mom proud. I'm sure you will. And no Yuki. Hope so. Your heart sounds to be in the right place. That was the first step. I've asked you, you two your goals in the past, in being here. Actually, did I ask you, Elenia, why you came to Rosewood originally? And what your goal is now? Do you really think so? <laughs> I can say it again if you want. I don't mind. If you want to share it with the other two. the question again? Mm. What is your goal in being in Rosewood? Being here? Mm. Uh, when I first got to Rosewood, it was to give the people hope. That there is a possible brighter future. Mm. Mm. It is still is a bit of uh, that, mm, but mostly my new goal is to keep everybody, all of you, safe mm. while we fight for this. <laughs> Honorable want and wish. It's not going to happen. As long as I can keep not in this line of work. We are not safe so long as we fight. The evil are my everything right now. I do not have anything else. So you all are all important. I 
different question. Or Go certainly on. a question of a different sort. Were it your choice, where would you all that we go next? From here. Mac Terrorist asked something similar a couple of days ago, stating that Andrian needed us most, but that Kulani could be a step ahead. I'll admit, I don't know these places. I do not know what part of the world that we are on. I'll go where I'm needed. What of you, Avi? I feel it's a bit unfair for me to answer that question. Why? Because I know how much my home is suffering. It's always been on my mind. <laughs> now that we have the shield. And until we know how to close the rifts. The only choices we make that are of any value, of any matter, are which lives we save. We won't save everyone. Riker, there's certainly a lesson there. Should it have been needed? <laughs> I terrorist didn't think so. Taras is an idiot. He really does prove that age doesn't mean wisdom and experience. <laughs> I always idolized him a bit, but after that... It's a bold statement. I can't look at him the same way. I've never been his greatest fan, but I'll admit. He has rarely had suggestions I find particularly valuable, and he once killed a Ferali to stop Malik from killing the rest or some such or another nonsense. Good. You agree with him? <clears throat> that is, I suppose, your decision to make. They really need to kill one of someone? One die. It's no different from a child stepping on a bug. All die. An old powerful mage taking out a Ferali? I 
a man of hundreds of years of life who can't come up with a better option for arguing. That's not He's a supposed kill. to That's be a... wise. That's a slaughter. Even I see that the Follies are almost no threat to us. We are enlightened ones. We just have to snap our fingers and you would just be gone. We just choose not to because that's just not the way we want to do things. Malik. No. Checks out. Actors That's true. kill. Stop Malik to worse. If Actaris actually gave a damn about the Ferali, he would have simply stopped Malik from killing any of you. That's the difference. You're expendable to him. And the fact that he got away with killing fewer is because it's slightly more convenient. He didn't do it to save you. He did it to save the initiative from the unhappiness that would have happened had Malik killed all the Ferali. He didn't save you because you matter. He saved you because you're an inconvenience. You can think like all of us. You can say stuff like that. The Ferali really weren't trying to stop working. They had been told by students that they're not slaves, and you're not. And they didn't understand what it meant. So they th said things, because that's what you do. You parrot things. Indeed, as they described it to me at the time, they intended to work. They wanted to work they had been told that things should work differently but they were still enthusiastic about making a difference and contributing Very true. But then I think a lot of the students would be long dead if we were in other places. convinced that the professors wouldn't see a couple of the students dead if it could make their lives easier. Are you often told that you would be killed if you were elsewhere right now?
probably share my position on where we should head to then next. Please. I assumed your silence was intentional. <laughs> I was thinking. I'm similar to Avi. I need Maybe to find alchemy. Like Fucking odds. Hello. Are you busy? Um, not currently. Do you have a place that you work? Uh, yes, there's the alchemy building on the airship. The alchemy building, the alchemy room. Could you show me? Yeah, of course. to go on the top deck. And it's the dawn below. Your name is Robert, right? And yes. What do you call that potion that you made for Yuki? It was not specifically made for Yuki. Okay, the official name that I originally came with was the potion of free spirit. But... Uh, Soon decided to call it Potion of Courage, and basically, it is made to make you drunk. It's alcohol. A bit more complicated than that, but yes. Do you charge for it? Not really. I, I don't think... I don't know how money works, so... Yeah, it's free. Is it expensive to make? Uh, not really, just a bit of alcohol and a few uh, alchemical ingredients. Do you have any on hand? Yes, I always have a stock that I keep afloat. Do I name? I want to subscribe to it, if you will. A supply, a consistent stream. If you want to, any reason in particular? We can call it training. I will. Also, I just want to ask, did you, are you well, um, are you have you already drank in your life? Have that? No, alcohol in general. Yes. Okay, good, because yeah I made the mistake to directly giving this to you you Yuki and um Luca. They never drank in their life. 
If I wanted to have smaller effects, would I take smaller dosages or could I water it down with another liquid? Uh, you can water it down. I'm not interested in being in debt to someone. I won't take these for free. Uh, I don't know. Uh, when you when you go out and you see alchemical ingredients or such, like I can take those if you if you really want to pay back. Could you show me what they look like? Uh, of course. There's a show example in this box here. Mm. Oh, there is those that are pretty common also. Are any of them harmful to the skin? Should I wear hand coverings? Uh, nope. Uh, the ones that are mostly harmful are... Yeah, here. Yeah. These ones you mustn't touch with your bare hands. I'll remember it. Yeah. Then I will bring you ingredients. Frequently. It is your plan, right? But like, yeah, it's, a, it's not really a problem. I told you already. I'm not doing it for free. Okay. Do you make anything else? Um... Well, I'm uh, mostly the one uh, in charge of keeping the ingredients afloat and I'm um, restocking the uh, basic portion regularly. Mm. Then I'm happy to know that I'll be helping you with your task. If you do end up crafting anything else, I'd be curious to know what you can make. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, no problem. Have a good day.
I mentioned wanting to talk to him alone about all of that over the winter. Why is he large? Hello. Hey, um, Toriel is looking for you. She's down there. Oh, actually, right there. Mm. She said she was looking for you. Thank you. Mm hmm. for the bro the um Ventus Vent you're your team yay you're Thank a team you. how do you have more for Ollie mm. than what I left you with why do you sound like that drink this it's good uh what is this pomegranate juice it's my favorite <laughs> all right It's just that you d disappeared, and, uh, well, um, you see, I, um, here, but I, I just was wondering where you were the whole 
time. I, well, not the whole time. I don't, I'm not that desperate. Like, I, I'm not that desperate to worry the whole time. I didn't worry the whole time. Did I worry the whole time? I didn't worry the whole time. But what, what I'm trying to say is, um, well, uh, congratulations. And I wanted to just uh, spend some time with, with you. And that stalker, it's... <laughs> Hello. It is a good one. I even found trouble today, believe it or not. Anyways. You um, found trouble. Did you celebrate, huh? Yeah, I found trouble. What sort of trouble? Um, there was this guard person that wanted to speak to me, and they wanted to speak to the Feralis, and they were asking of very things that made me angry. So, so I hissed at him, and and I, I couldn't let them just take the Feralis. I, I, Mm. Was he going to take them? I know. He wanted to question them, and I'm not gonna let them just speak their gibberish and get into trouble or anything. I think they would have been alright. If they were innocent. Uh, they, they are. I, I promise they are. Stay out of trouble. Or, mm, I'll try. Don't let me find out about it. Eh? Eh. Why? Why? Are you gonna scold me? I can. What? I can go find the guard right now. I'm sure he would love to talk to you. No, you're not gonna go find the guard right now. You don't need to scold me. You're gonna stop me. I am gonna stop you, yes. Alright, stop me. Uh, uh, um... I, I, I grab your tail, but I cannot pull, so I just literally just follow you grabbing your tail. But, 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 but... Oh, I'm not gonna pull on it! It's gonna hurt you! <laughs> but, but so earlier! That's unfair! I'm teasing you. I don't give two shits what that guard wants. Okay, good. Because if a fight would have broken out, I would have probably died! You're not going to die. No, no, I can get in trouble because I probably will have bad consequences. But not as bad as you, you're gonna get killed or something. Hmm. You're not gonna hit anybody with a rock, fuck it. Yeah, fuck. I will pretend like I know what you just said. Just don't, don't hurt anyone, fuck it. It's fine, I can take care of myself, sort of, to some extent. We did drink from the dirty river because I d didn't know if, if I could grab the, the water. Wait, you drink from there? Free. I thought you were just swimming in there. No, I was blowing bubbles with my nose and I was also, I drank it a little bit. Um. Yeah. Anyways, um... That happened. She might have parasites. Wait... Have you gotten shorter? Wait, did you say she might have parasites? Parasites? Am I going to die? Maybe. What? No! <laughs> Was it maybe yes? <laughs> yes? No, no, what do you mean? <laughs> like, I'm so sorry earlier. Help me. <laughs> what was she doing? Die? Like, eating I raw ham or. I drank like... raw ham. I'm not gonna eat raw. I mean, probably wouldn't really hurt me either because. What is but uh, I drank from the river, and apparently the river comes from the city, and that's probably. It's poopy water. It's poopy water. Oh, <laughs> I, yeah, yeah, that's it's what the. Poopy the water. For. <laughs> <laughs> I made a mistake. If I'm gonna die, take care of the Feralis, because I also allowed them to drink from it. They did what I did. Well, I'm, I'm not sure if you hunt down, uh, you know, probably even just Lothario over there. Yeah. Over at medical right now. Nice and useful. Probably could you huh. a dewormer or something? I Perhaps you should. Go. Oh, yeah. But, but wait, you, uh, um. You're looking oh, very yeah, short so. today. What's up with that? Oh, for fuck's sake. Anyway, have a good one. Thank 
he looks taller. Can is he growing up? What's going on with him? Uh, anyways. Go. Fair All enough. of you. Wait, but 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 I need to speak to you the whole day. I, I try to find you. And the then I'll stay. Fine. Go. Best example for you guys. I think I poisoned myself and all of you too. Hi guys. Hello. What's that? I think I poisoned myself and all of them by drinking from the very disgusting river. So now I need a medic. <laughs> that was a lot of that in it. Hey. Oh, <laughs> Letharial just. Why is the Letharial still in there? Uh, Am I gonna die? Oh. Uh, I got it. <laughs> Uh, I. Do you know anything about medical stuff? No, Lothario's over there. Okay, uh, I'll get Lothario. You guys just sit down in there. I feel just fine. Maybe I'll die in the morning. Maybe I will have a very painless and happy death, surrounded by friends. Instead. Why is there only what? one of you that can listen? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, you're right. <laughs> wow, Almond, you're becoming her favorite. Don't, don't you steal my role. Eh? No? <laughs> no steal? <laughs> no steal. Bad steal. Am I your favorite? I'm your favorite, right? Drink this. <laughs> okay, I'll drink this more. But does that mean that I'm your favorite <laughs> because you're sharing food with me? I'm not going to answer that question. From the head doctor. Oh. Hmm? You guys should be fine. I don't know if I should take that uh, as laziness, not wanting to <laughs> help us, but that is completely fine then. We're fine. We're fine, everyone. Oh, We're not they, gonna die. You know, sleep. They have a team thing happening. So, uh, it's not laziness. Oh, They're just busy. I see. Busy. All right. Busy and hmm. laziness. <laughs> I could get Talia. <laughs> Stagger. Stagger, no. It's all right. It's all right. I, I mean, I hope we're going to be fine. Actually. We all roll. <laughs> Have you guys seen any yarn bar yarn balls? Mm. Mm -mm. Yarn hands. You too? With the yarn stuff? They're looking for it, and I would find it really funny if one of the Ferali found it before them. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I see. <laughs> also, the team stuff we love to find the yarn stuff, of course. Replaceable and Valuable as a yarn ball. Uh, anyways, I drank a little bit from it here. I wasn't talking about value. <laughs> sorry. I'm, oh, sorry, Stacker. Are you okay? It's okay. Yes. I didn't mean. Oh, Careful, you may really fix her, his muzzle. If you do oh. that, you may fix his I'm muzzle. Sorry. <laughs> Is his mouth fucked up? <laughs> Holy shit, I love it. Uh, um. What was I gonna say? Oh yeah, they're just looking around for the yarn, yarn ball. I don't know where it could be. Careful, it's sharp. Ooh. Mal, maybe maybe you can sniff it out. <gasps> you should make a little prayer and see if you can sniff it out, right? Hmm? <laughs> Try. Oh, my nose is that good? Feel so cool. one heavy. It might be heavy to you. <laughs> there should be daggers in the training field. Some that you could carry if you wanted to. Heavy. <laughs> what? Safe. Heavy. Where'd you get that from, if you don't mind me asking, that is? <laughs> I really yeah. like how, how it looks. Where'd you get the knife from? Flint. Sarvira's father is a blacksmith. Ah. That's that's really cool. <laughs> mm. 
You should practice. It would only do you some good. Maybe Toriel can teach you, you since she's been learning. Uh, I'm actually looking for one. Uh, are the medics? Ha <laughs> Yes, we're all gonna die. It's I don't fine. know. I mean, there's over there a Toriel. It takes time. Doing something. You're going to be fine, Toriel. No need to freak out. Right. Just water. I'll Not be fine. Strong. You'll be something fine. Wrong? I drank from the dirty, disgusting river, and they all copied me too. So. Well, the most that might happen is a die. stomach bug, but I even doubt it. Yeah, well, why are you gonna die now? I'm worried. I'll just a joke. I don't <sighs> <laughs> I'll, I'll go find a medic for you. Thank you. Uh, it's alright, Genichi. Oh, I thought you meant for us. <laughs> <laughs> That's fine. We will be fine, all of us, hopefully. Well, if you're not, then I have another reason to hate Lothario, so... <coughs> oh, wow. Right, that is true. <laughs> it's fine, I'll be fine. I drank dirty water my whole life. Never coming from an actual city, I admit it. But, 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 but more like sand, water, mud water, all that weird water. Speaking of, I'm oh. thirsty. <sighs> I'm sure you'll be fine. Uh, how did it go with your new team, Va Ventus? I apologize. Put the lid on. It went fine. We spoke most of the day. Over by the crystals. And what did you speak about? The usual song and dance of ask what you can do and figure out where you came from and why you're fucked up. Oh, um. Oh. Better to get out of the way now. So you mean you shared your life with them or something like that? I didn't share most of it. Avi shared how I got my scars. Shared what my clan tried to do to you and him. And why we're back. Uh, um, did, did you did, did you speak much? Did you partake in conversation? <laughs> Lots of it? Not a lot of it. You should be happy that I stayed. Unlike a certain wolf. Huh? What do you mean with that? I've come to notice that Yuki has a habit of running off for some reason. Oh, I noticed that too. I mean, they kind of arrived before anyone else and just didn't know where you guys were. Or maybe she just lied to me. That could be something. She knew where we were. She chose not to participate. Oh. I see. <laughs> mm. I also mm. sort of drained today, too. Good. By yourself, considering Jackson is gone currently. Um, no. Someone did help me. You see the one that has a little uh, lizard, <laughs> Percy and uh, Riley? They, mm -hmm. I mean, more like Riley showed me stuff, but yeah. Hmm. I'm proud of you. Proud of me? Or... What? For keeping up with your studies. Hmm. Yeah, I suppose. Thank you. Mm. I'm going to show you where we'll be sleeping. So that if you ever need me, you know where to find me. Oh, 
oh, oh, uh, I find you from, like, you sleep, you, uh, Team Vanta sleeps there? Yes. If you want to sleep in the room, you need to ask Jacqueline first. Oh, okay. Jacqueline, are they allergic to fur or something like that? No, it's simply her room as well. Oh, okay. Okay. Mm. Hail Sorale, Toriel, Sorale. Hello. If Jacqueline does not want you in her space, then you will not be permitted to be there. It is simple. Oh. Okay. Um. Though, you may be happy to know that I rather like Jacqueline. So far. Yes, I do like Jacqueline too. I hope she likes me back too, so of course. Have you spoken before? Yes, many, many times already. <laughs> I think she will allow me to sleep in the room. I don't know where she is. But... Navi. Hello. Hey. What's wrong? Finally, you also show up. Congratulations. Hmm. Thank you. Hmm. What was that? Nothing. I'm showing Toriel where we sleep. Ah. Yeah, I love a good Manto Ale and Octopus of some kind. Hmm. What? I don't know. It was it was near the training ground. Mm. How did your talk go with Talia? I suppose it went well. it better that it has um you know symbols instead of writings i couldn't probably find it again if it did <coughs> have writing i can't write i can't read mm. avi's in here too if you need either of us and you are not welcome here then this is where you'll be able to find us all right that that's all right and what if you want to find uh me well I'll be closed. Uh, I'll be closed. It's fine. I'm almost certain that there is, um, um, there are bunks up on the top deck. It's close to the, um, I think, Just the other library? Side. Oh, um, I think I prefer it under here. But, but it's fine. Don't, don't worry about it. I, it's not like I can really pick well. what I prefer and uh, any of that. Huh? Some of the auxiliary force members have a room. There's a chance that you could requisition one if you find roommates. Maybe if three of you request one, you can get one together. Do you? Apparently. Does anyone 
is here anyone like to have anyone sleeps on here perhaps i don't know oh okay okay um that makes sense how, how do you sleep like with i mean i don't think other team now but do you really trust them sleeping around them like they could have saved you no but I'm pretty confident that I could kill her before she killed me. Okay. Good. Um, sure, alright. If anyone tries to kill you, I know that you can manage. But what about Avi, though? He has the high ground. <laughs> <laughs> alright, then. Um, yeah, you guys are safe. <laughs> I'll manage somewhere. It's fine. I'll figure it out. Y yeah. Talk to Jacqueline. At least. Then yeah, you'll know. I should. Even if it's an occasional sleepover. Okay. Better than nothing. You're right. <laughs> I think we have some bandages to change. Stop. Ow. There's a medical area on the ship, isn't there? Yeah, we passed it. I'll come along. <laughs> it's okay, pocket. It's fine. He's just staring at you because you're really pretty. You do have pretty eyes. She is very pretty. <laughs> this way. Thank you. I don't get it. Huh, well, how? Lothario, Lothario and Talia, they're not single. <laughs> you know, I don't get it either. Hmm. Why are they putting their love life up on a chart? I have a oh, feeling sorry it... Sorry to interrupt. There are four DM cards of all colors. That is the Pavandorian suit of armor in, d in pieces. Oh boy, where are they? Um, they're being carried. I don't know where they're we taking them. Okay, they're, I guess those like are the only DM cards in the map. Oh, okay, cool. All right. The circle means they're single, apparently. I have, I have a feeling it doesn't have anything to do with their actual love oh. life, but I don't know what it means either. So. Huh. Interesting. I don't know anything about medical things. I don't know if there's anything to help with the pain of them. Um, usually put like an antibiotic on it. Um, but I don't know what that is. Um, it should look like something like a very clear liquid. Uh -huh. 
Water. I want to shake your hand. Uh, yeah, mm -hmm. kind of watery and it should have a strong scent, a very, very strong scent. This is kind of clear. <laughs> okay, cool. Huh. Anyway, this might be it. Hmm. I don't know if you know medical, but it's a resistance potion. <laughs> That doesn't look right. <laughs> it's the clearest one they have, and it smells strong. Smell. I don't think that's it. It doesn't smell like alcohol at all. Mm. I can help you scent. At least I can do something useful. I, I, yeah. Uh, at least. Hmm. Check one of the med kits. Hmm. There is a liquid in there. A liquid in there? Oh. Smell. Ah, very strong, yes. I think it's the right one. I took too much of a good to sniff with that one. Hmm. You got it. Carefully interrupt them. Did you do these yourself? As best as I could. You could have asked for help. Well, but then I'd ruin the spies. You didn't have to tell me how you got them. You could have still asked for help to wrap your hand. Mm. I guess I didn't want to risk it. Towel on your lap. Put your hands on the towel. Mm. If I'm gonna pour alcohol on them, I'd rather not make a mess. The uh, towel oh, should oh, you don't soak pour the rest. Oh, you don't pour it. Hmm? You, you, um, you, like, pour some of it, a little bit of it on, i.e., like a napkin or a towel, and then, like, and then rub the wet part of it on, you know, the wound. Ah, ah, Grabbing it in Okay, towel. yeah, okay. Don't worry. Ah. Don't worry about it. Okay, uh, you know, it, 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 it stings, by the way, but that's a good thing. Ow. Wouldn't Ow. it sting no matter what? Well, you know, it, 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 it's disinfecting the, um, the, the, um, bacteria, you know, the, the bad mm -hmm. stuff that gets in, the germs, and that's what's painful. Dabbing it off. Also kind of burning the inside. Ow. Ow. Gentle. It's your fault it for getting burns. hurt. I was trying my best. Grab. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh, um, yeah. We, we can we can speak right now if you want that. <laughs> Come to the side while they're doing their medical stuff. Sorry, I got distracted. Uh, one moment. <coughs> Is this one worse than the other one? About the same. Doesn't really taste infected. You 
you know how infected tastes? No. It's kind of like when a cow's milk goes bad. You can just sort of tell. It's not discolored. It's not growing anything crusty, you know? Mm. Is it too tight? No. Does it hurt? A little bit, but that's to be expected. I think everyone appreciated you your gift. I hope so. They are a little loose, though. You said it hurt. Yeah, it's still the alcohol. <clears throat> still fresh there. Then maybe you should heal them. I had my no. fun. I like them this way. You'll be more careful next time, though, right? <laughs> I was as careful as I can be. That was as careful as I can be. I swear. So what do you think about Ventus? Hmm? I think we made the right choice. Are you happy? Yes. Okay. As long as you're happy. Your happiness counts too. You are my happiness. You can't be surprised by that. It's just you admit it so openly. Come here, Floyd. It's the truth. There's really no sense in hiding it. I think it's pretty obvious that I'm here because of you in the first place. It's obvious in the fact that I've come back with you. And how I treat you. Sure. I want to leave this world a better place than when I found it. But quite frankly, Avi, if you're not in it, then what's the fucking point? Victoria. It was 
a false alarm. Oh, if you ever heard us say anything, we're good. Everything's fine. Don't worry, man. Everything's fine. Exactly. I like that tomorrow, more than you know. Perhaps you're right. About? It's hard for me to always understand what's going on behind those eyes. But I know you're always thinking about things. I know you have a lot of feelings. But I don't understand them. Hmm. Much are you aware of it? Hmm. What? You said you don't always understand. What about the parts you do understand? I'd like to think that I know you. I'd like to think that I can tell by your tone of voice whether or not you're in a good mood or a bad one, or that something's happened or you've had a good day. I can tell by the flick of your ears, if they're upright or droop. I can see that your tail is wagging, and I know that you are at least happy. Though I don't know if it's happiness specifically. I can tell when you're looking at me or if you're not. If your eyes are more open or if they're closed. The corners of your mouth, if they're upturned or down. The way you move your hands, the way you stand. I'd like to think, Avi, that I know you. And it's the only thing that I know. Um... I don't know what to say to that. Say nothing. You asked a question. I answered it. Right. But it's because I know you that I will also give Ventus a chance. Because I know what they mean to you. And I know what it means to be on a team, even if I don't necessarily care. It's why I don't glare every time I look at Aqua. Or why I've given Yuki a second chance. In some way or another, Avi, everything always comes back to you. In some ways, you are my strength, but you are also my weakness. As selfishly as happy as that makes me, I always do wish the day you find more ambition.
I don't feel for much. I don't know if that's the curse of magic that flows through me or the harsh reality of the past. It makes it difficult to be ambitious. It makes it difficult to, difficult to care. Toriel has asked me several times since we've met if I care about her, if I love her, if she is my favorite. And not once have I ever given her a straight answer. Because as much as she is important, I don't know how to let more of that in. It's too much for me to want things of you. But I hope you don't force them upon yourself to a point where it's a burden. Would you still accept no matter how I never changed? Yes. In me, my one and only Sorlia. Then so long as you accept me, as I am, then it's not a burden. When I stop being good enough, that's when I won't be able to handle it. But at that point, I will just leave. You've always said you don't deserve to be my wife by my side. I don't think it's a matter of that. I 
Carlin sumir. I... I can't gauge how deserving I am. But it doesn't matter. If you deserve it, I don't deserve it. Cause it's what I want. There comes a point in the future, as you say. That becomes clear to you that you don't deserve it. And you just end up going away because of it. Then I'd rather stay in this moment right here, sitting in this med bay. Things won't change if we don't leave. I'm gonna cry. <laughs> oh, I can see this being a key moment Sorler looks back on in every strife. I've never said it out loud. Because I believe that actions speak louder than words ever could. So long as you want me around, I'll never run from you again. Good. But I've already proven you could go to the far ends of the earth and I'd find you. I still don't understand how that was happening. How that was able to happen. I don't think that because I could have been further away from you, Avi. And you still managed it. Did you give yourself a flower? Yes. What's lame as that sounds? It's not. I almost wish you hadn't. <laughs> I would have found you one. Oh, what I... How would I liked it better than... <laughs> Maybe I still will. I'll be making alchemical errands for Robert while we're here, in general, with Rosewood. I'm not going to lie to you. I have subscribed to more of his Potions of Courage. 
that what he calls it? He calls it a potion of free spirit. But everyone else calls it something else. I intend to water them down when I use them, though. I have no intentions of making a fool of myself. Seriously, those things can put Vivarin on, like, beverages to shame. I wouldn't know. But they make me feel better when I train. I wasn't expecting them to hit so hard. I apologize for anything that I said. Nah, it's okay. Come back. <laughs> Say please. Come back. <laughs> you get a victory this time. I'll count my blessings. Shall we make our rounds? See what everyone is up to? Yeah. If it is a quiet night, I may turn in. Mm. But we have I might stay. four other people now to indulge us. Yeah. You could have walked. I know. <laughs> Zippy, so. Mm hmm. I think we scared Tori all away. Also, I apologize for choosing the furthest bed. It wasn't initially my intention. Okay. As long as that's out of the way. I just realized that the only space for me to put the shield was against the wall of that bed. Not gonna lie, I was kind of looking forward to, like, rolling off my bed and landing on you. Well, now you can roll off your bed and land on Jacqueline. It's not as good. Well, I don't want to look a fool for asking her to switch now. I suppose I'll have to get, just get closer to Jacqueline to make sure it's okay. Do you want me to switch? I don't <laughs> want to inconvenience you. Sorry. You won't. I'm sure it won't bother her to have the shield there, even though that's where she sleeps. Besides, in hindsight, if an intruder ever did come through our door, I would rather be where she was sleeping currently. (laughs) 
Maybe I should get the bottom bunk then. No. You get top bunk. That's because you're... But... But... Don't. Don't you start. Don't. <laughs> Enjoy the top bunk. I'll share my shelving space with you. I noticed that there were some drawers underneath my mattress. Well, my soon-to-be mattress, as I'm sure Jacqueline won't mind. But I will ask her. Hmm. I kind of wonder if she sleeps that mask on. I wanted to ask her why she wore it, but thought it too soon. I am relieved, though. That she doesn't use magic. Hmm. I'm sure she doesn't see it the same way as I do. But I find relief in sitting next to her now. Hmm. You two have uh, some things in common. Oh? Yeah. <laughs> you don't want to elaborate? I can't remember them specifically, but you guys agreed upon some things. I know that our goals are similar. Yes, exactly. <laughs> See, you guys are just alike. Mm. We have common interests. Yeah. I just look at you both. You both are just a carbon copy of each other. <laughs> like a spitting image. Oh, God. It's really hard to tell people from the ducks. Oh, look, there's Yuki. Yeah, I thought that was Luca running at us, but now I see that Luca is standing there. I, I said he looked just he looks just like Luca. <laughs> wanted to. And if you wanted to invite anyone else, that's cool too. Uh, you Yuki. Hey guys. You didn't say hi to him. I know. Why? He's a penalty sympathizer. Uh. Is that Jacqueline? Truth be told, truth be told, and by uncommon belief, sorry. There are people I cannot like, too. I believe you. I just also believe that someday you'll forgive some of them. Not all of them. Everyone looks the same at night. That one? Um, is there? No, not that one. No. Oh. It's not fun. Them. This is fun. This is it's, this is like a game. Um, it's like trying to guess people out in the dark. Um, eh, eh, uh, um, I can't tell. <laughs> I can't tell. I can't tell. <sighs> um, Connor? Let's make a game out of this. Tell it, trying to distinguish people in the dark. I can't tell who's over there. Then take a wild guess.
Mm. I don't know. Murtesh. Gallop. Huh. Wow, even in broad light, you couldn't tell. I was thinking about something else. I see what everyone else is doing outside. Cause... Oh, never right. mind. They're yep. coming in. Yep. Evening. Welcome. Hello. Hi. How are we doing? Were, like, Surprise. It's an intervention. Someone was trying to find you earlier. Oh, uh, you talking about. Okay. I don't know. I couldn't think of a bit. Um, well, who are you looking for? Okay. Jacqueline. I guess. Jacqueline, try Aqua Camp. Ugh. We tried. She's not there. Also, I don't know what the intervention is, so I didn't know what we How interrupted. We building, baby? Bye. What? Oh, yeah. Um, the cat. Yeah. The cat. Sorry, we're just playing a game. Don't mind us. At first glance, I want to say that that's Realm, but we haven't seen Realm. Hmm. Someone with, like, gradient hair. It's really, really hard to tell. Maybe she's on maybe the airship. Throw a rock at them. Don't throw. Well, maybe. Yeah, it'll disturb them, and they'll be like, "Who goes there?" And then I'll be like, "Oh, it's them." Ah, go. Oh. Hi. Have you seen Jacqueline? Um, no. Um. Shame. Yeah, what what are good night. Who's who, who's Sacket? Stacker. Stacker. Oh. Uh, oh, right. That's one of the bread stacking Karalis. Mm -hmm. This is annoying. Are they still there? Yeah. Is that Jacqueline? There's a plus one there. Is that Jacqueline? No, it's Gillip. Hey, Raleigh. Maybe we can ask them? Sure. Uh, it's the one farthest towards the waterfall. So your tent will be the one closest to the waterfall, sorry. Okay. Yeah. And then right. Lucia's tent, Push. Lucia and Amber's tent is the one that's farthest from the waterfall. Yeah. So you'll be at the middle one. Are we switching <coughs> on June? Oh, yeah. Uh, okay. Push. <laughs> I'm like right in the middle here. No, we're just waiting patiently. <laughs> oh, sorry. Oh, thank you for, for the flower, by the way. Jacqueline. Uh, of course. Hmm? I'm confused now. But, uh, <laughs> looking for Jacqueline. But yes, you're welcome for the rose. I haven't seen Jacqueline, unfortunately. Oh, he's Rowan. Hmm. Maybe we could ask Rowan. Oh, jeez. Well. <laughs> is he a Rowan fucking slingshotted? Slingshotted into the... I think maybe so Rowan does got some pretty severe wood. Make sure he's slingshotted into the wall. He almost looked at a pace on the side of the mountain. Hmm. <sighs> Where does she even go? If we want to find Jacqueline, we gotta think like her. 
Maybe she went to their tents. Hmm. Or the cave? Or the airship? Those are the only places I have left. Look. He looks kind of like Jacqueline up there. It does kind of look like Jacqueline. I want to run up there and check. Sure. I've been thinking about getting a sword. Oh, oh, by myself? Oh. No. Okay. You want a sword? Yeah, I've been about getting a s Yeah. Why? To fit the hero aesthetic. What about your spear? Heroes had oh, spears. Uh, yeah. I think that's more of a warrior aspect. Um, but... <laughs> um, I just the whole think, like... Oh. Um, my spear is very long range. I, I fight someone up close, I probably wouldn't stand a chance. <laughs> so the sword might be a good multi-tool. How do I... Get up, get good. Oh, wait, up. It's so dark. We were right. Hey. Are we interrupting? I wanted to bother you about something momentarily. It's super minor and not all that private. I wanted to swap beds. Uh, sure. Only if you don't mind. I don't mind at all. Appreciate it. Feel free to move my sword and my other belongings out of the way. Mm. I'll be delicate with them. Thank you. I hope you two sleep well. <laughs> the things I do for you. But also me. That was a you little want me embarrassing. To fall, on you? fall on me? No, but being closer yeah. seemed to have made you happy. Yeah? It does, does not make you happy? Of course it does. I just say it in less words. It makes me happy. One, two, three, four. Say it in less words. That's not fair! What do you mean? That's... That's how I say it. You can any words! You can just tell. You, you glare at me? I what smiled you at you! You couldn't tell oh. I was smiling? It's dark. <laughs> <laughs> there was a smile. We're having a... We're having a difficult time telling people we're apart that are like ten feet away from us. I know. Well, everyone's scattered. <sighs> what do you want to do about it? Don't know. You said you were going to stay up. Yeah, just a little longer, perhaps. Mm-hmm. If you'd like to go to bed, I'll, you know... I'll head to bed when I'm ready. Mm-hmm. 
I just am not certain what I would do with my time. But if you had something in mind, I would give it a shot. Hmm. We just haven't had dinner. You want dinner? Yeah. But then again, I don't want to interrupt the intervention. Whatever that means. There's an entire kitchen in the airship. Right. Right. Dinner it is. That's for all the parmigrin again. Did you? Parmigrin? I can't stop myself. I want to die. Progress. Stop. Stop. <laughs> 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 Pomegranate. <laughs> when I'm done, you're done. Yes, I'm done. You promise? Until I think of another, uh, up until I think of another clever one. How about this? If you make another joke, I'll pull your ear. They were, yeah. they were covering their faces in, in their own words. Yeah. When they Bronson. What? You didn't hear him. He said Ventus. Oh, I didn't, I didn't hear that. I was too busy, like, thinking about other important things, like other funny, clever ways to say pomegranate. <laughs> those, those leaves just combed my hair. <laughs> You're not as tall as I am. No, no. Also. Also? Hmm. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> I saw it sitting in the grass after everyone's conversation. I was gonna go get it. Don't you think you've had enough? We're not gonna have enough space, no. like, in the bags anymore. You chose this. Oh. I thought you'd really like it. It's so what? bright huh? in here. Oh, yeah. I do like them, but now I want more of them. You know how this works. Uh. Yeah, but... You You're not what? a stranger to the Dragon's Horde thing. Singapore has become part of the dragon's hide. But yes, flowers, bones, and now you've turned me on to crystals. Flowers turn you on. <laughs> it just means that I like them. Oh. Don't make it weird. That. That's the way you said it. Do you know how to make any of this? I think so. Mm. Um. You. Uh -huh. What is that? It's a dumpling. 
It usually has meat in it. Okay. Can I have another one? Hello? Yeah. Oh, greetings. Hmm. I wasn't expecting others on the ship. Hey, Lafon. What are you doing? Dinter. Eating. <laughs> um, right. Apparently, there's a whole. Uh, uh, what is it? Gathering down in the uh, main area? You both didn't want to come by? I heard there was an intervention. Huh? An inter a what? What? It's an intervention? Or was it a I heard that was a drinking thing for a lot of people. Is it a drinking yeah. intervention? I'll drink to it. We didn't uh, hear about that's it. That's how it works. Yeah, we oh, weren't invited. Uh, We're not cool enough. Everyone's invited. Come on. Who's hosting it? Everyone. Uh, no one's directly hosting it. I heard Galeb heard about it and then immediately ran to it, so I'm assuming that it's probably good enough for him. G Galeb was then. He didn't invite us. Yeah, because he didn't know about it well, originally either. Tell you what. Galeb's on my team, and I control it. I am invited you. You can come if you would like to. I don't mind. We can be the orc. Alright. The thought is up to you. I'm going to go collect my purchase. Uh, uh, eat your. commander taking full tyranny rights. That's not tyranny. Tyranny would be forcing you guys. <laughs> be taking the word of someone else and twisting it. <laughs> Could you stand side by side I don't for a second? I take it that far. Hmm? What? Huh? Huh? Could you stand next to each other for a second? Oh, uh, sure. Hmm. 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 Yeah, you're right. Not the same. Huh? Yeah, I'm taller. Mm, he's, he's rather a bit taller, yes. And that's the only difference? Blue eyes. Oh, and See, we're nothing alike. Eyes, yes. He also wears teal. As of today. <laughs> oh, and beforehand, he wore black. <laughs> oh, is it your hand okay? Or hands blow? Oh, wrong way. That is not the one. And it's, it's not this one either. It should be this one. Where are we going? I don't know. Mess That's off. why I was trying to follow him. Uh, okay. <laughs> uh, did you guys either s either of you see where Toriel went? She may have gone to bed. Yeah. All right. Yeah. But did, what do you, Lafan? What do you? What do you? What do you? What do you? <laughs> isn't isn't that what they do for celebrations? <laughs> You know, it's something of that sort. Uh, if I'm, really, I'm, I'm just getting prepared. You know, I haven't. Yeah, but I don't know. After the gala, I, I had to learn how to dance, and so I'm trying to, you know, pick up at the. Are you telling things. me that there's going we to really be dancing? We didn't miss out. We could well, run. I, maybe. I'm you, I'm okay with running. Run? I got energy. I got all the energy in the world. As do I. I think Toriel just woke up. Well, apparently I don't know enough. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. Hmm. Hi, apparently they're drinking in the mess hall. There's a party there or Are something like that. The thing? Uh, Are they still having the thing at the mess hall? If, oh, no. if there isn't, then Lafon and you lied to us. <laughs> I didn't mean to. It was just what I thought was happening. N liar. <laughs> Not on purpose. <laughs> we'll see. Accidental. Accidental. You did accidental liar. But there, we'll, we'll compromise. That's, that's your name. I know what. No, 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 no,
You can call me Yori. Can't call me Yavi. All right, I'll call you Avi. <laughs> There's a torch there, so that must be a good sign. Mm. We're off to a good start. Even if you got in the sin, why would be a gray zone wow. for that specific person? Oh. Oh. I thought other people were supposed to be here. <laughs> yeah. I don't know who's telling everyone that there's drinking here. I heard someone say it, and then people were pointing, bringing drinks here, so I thought that was happening. Who's been bringing drinks here? I, I saw I someone doing it a while ago. Like, like, right. We oh, brought drinks here. <laughs> yeah, but it's not exactly a drink, it's just a drink. Maybe we should act. Hmm. Well, where's a team leader? I got an idea. No, that wouldn't be working well. Does anyone know how to plan like an actual like party thing? Celebration uh, it's called thing? having it earlier in the day and talking to everyone and then rounding them up at <laughs> the end of the day. Well, this is no party. Right, then I know. Uh, we can just go. Uh, sorry for interrupting, then. Uh oh. You're mm -hmm. fine. <clears throat> hey, pockets. Uh, sorry, both of you guys. I... Oh, oh look, Toriel! Uh, I feel really strange. Well, it's Toriel. You look the, uh, for it, weren't you? Yeah, I was. Uh, well, there you go. I'm sorry, both of you guys. Well, <laughs> the phone's about to be a liar, too, so you're not gonna be alone in that aspect. Unless they found what, 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 uh, 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 <laughs> I was misinformed. It was completely yes. misinformed. Yes. So they there is what one. Is happening in there? <laughs> I think it's one of talk. I, it's either a private talk or one of his story times. I don't know which one. I feel really bad, so I don't want to stop by and ask again. Sorry for scaring you off earlier. Scaring me off? In what way? You don't like it when Avi and I are. Avi and I. No, 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 no! You didn't scare me off. I was actually being too hard. No, no, I don't need that. Also, I just, I was being. Um, it's fine. I, it's, I actually like it. I mean, I mean, it's fine that you guys are having good time together and you know strengthening your relationship. We could just hold I mean, our own thing in the mess hall of the airship. Oh. Oh, never mind. It's kind of getting late, though, you need. You wanted to stay up. I wanted to have dinner. Well, then let's continue dinner. Okay. Of course you are. You, no matter what sort of thing we hold, will always have the open invite. Also, I don't know if you're deep talking, but you sound very whispery. I was very quiet. I, I was so in shock. You, you, you actually mean it? You, um, both of you? Yeah. Yes. Anything. You have the open air, but you are the guest of honor. You are the VIP. Apologies, but liar, 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 liar. No, liar. I was told him about it. I thought it's all my fault. I'm really sorry. <laughs> Don't blame him. But it's so easy. It's okay. Who says liar? I lie of nothing. I, I would think with the information said there was that I was a party. Told, I I said there was a party that was being planned, and I maybe he's so well, wrong. No, wait. You said no, it was happening I in the mess hall at the same party. moment. It was completely my fault. All right. This is information that was right, retold by another party. It's not my fault that it's not concurrent with what was going on in the mess hall. It might have you been a little too late. You only spread the false information, man. Got it. What? No, I... Dude! Why don't I make it not false? Um... In a couple days, why don't we have a party on the mess hall? Or in the mess hall of the ship? Celebration to have everyone new on board. Then why don't you plan <clears> it? 
I will. Challenge accepted. Good. We'll be there. Yes. Yeah. Um, no challenge. I'll just go. I'm going the hey. Huh? I was looking for no, you for the body thing fine. you were describing. I'm hungry. Is that still... Yeah. ...a thing? Oh, Food, yeah. dip head. Uh, the the party? Huh? Party? Oh, I don't know. I think Pockets is very confused as to where to go. Mm, they found their way. Pockets is falling. Yeah, tell you. I wonder what they wanted. Mm. They look for Toriel frequently. You think he likes her? I think so. What about... Like... Like... I don't know. Mm. That's a broader question. Riley. No, that's how much. Excuse me. of Lumen has been extinguished. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> I mean, hopefully if they... Hopefully they I mean, I'm I'm, so I'll be honest with you. I thought you already knew. You think you could leave you I thought again. you were already aware about this entire thing. I found this out through Rin myself. Jeez. Right. Fair enough. So... I wanted to at least be on the same page as you as you said. No, hey, we, we, we just think that you had some other business to attend to or something. Business to attend to? Like your new group? A new, a new group? You mean the team? I don't know, you, you like went out to the side of the path of something and was talking to someone. Oh, you mean right now? Oh, no, 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 don't worry about it. I am, um, I'm figuring it out on my own. What's wrong? Okay. Am I figuring out? I don't know if I'm spiraling or figuring it out. We'll see Are you in I trouble? Go. Trouble. Physical, no. Emotional, maybe. Mm. What does he do again? Why is he here? Oh, um, he uh, helps people with emotional trouble. That's why he tends to also be around me a lot. Mm. All right. I know Malik was supposed to be that, but I can't imagine him being successful in that. Of course not. He's a dragonkin. <sighs> really, all I can imagine him being all like, he'd be like, like, where are your balls? <laughs> I don't. I still didn't find Jacqueline. That's it, Avi. I'm going to beat some sense into you. Maybe, maybe if we take you to Happy Pappy Land, we can get you some self confidence for you, Jackwagon. <laughs> you want more dumplings? Yes, please. Okay. We want dumplings too. We're getting down, please. <laughs> oh. I'd give you something sweet, but I don't know if you can drink it. Oh, wow. That was very nice. Thank you, Sir Alir, for giving it to a uh, pocket here. I'm rather fond of the Ferrali. We had some in Droza. Yeah, many really. Mm. That's why I'm fond of them too. <gasps> <Ow. sighs> 
I'll admit I'm not a fan of their rude tongue that they've developed since I've been gone from Rosewood, but Chicken. that one's good. I like that one. Yeah. I and they're I'm pretty. I'm also developing a rude tongue. I could cut it off for you. <gasps> you wouldn't. Would you cook it too? Try me. Mm. Put my tongue out to you. Pinch. Mm. Drop of pomegranate juice. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, it wasn't cutting it off, but I'm not. I'm not complaining. <laughs> I wouldn't do that to you. Glad to know I'm actually not on the kill list for you because I'm pretty sure there are people that are on that list. <laughs> do you even have it? A kill list? No, I don't. Not yet, at least. I'm not I mean, you there. must be doing something <laughs> when you're alone and just just being, like, yourself. You must be thinking of some very dark stuff or something like that, right? I mean, that's what I imagine. Mm. I know you would never hurt me, but I have the feeling. <laughs> I don't think about killing people. You're thinking about other ways to make them suffer greatly without killing them. <laughs> I don't even think of that. It's not oh, really my you. agenda to kill people. So your agenda is to enter history by killing rift beasts. My goal is to make the world safer. If that involves killing mm. people, then I will do it. But I don't think about killing people. Mm -hmm. I see. But you would do... No, you know what? Okay, let me give you a little more space. Mm -hmm. The other day, I ate a plate of Lip. food. But I ate it so fast uh. that everyone in the room seemed to be... Almost upset. He eats fast too. <laughs> then this calls for eventually having a competition of eating something as fast as possible. You're gonna make yourself mm. sick. Maybe, but it's gonna be worth it, right? <laughs> It'll be worth it until we lose it. <laughs> That's true. That's true. And I'm still gonna wait for that to happen then. We should get like a big when we have more food we should get like a big you know what? I can I'm a gatherer. I can gather a lot of berries and make two big like baskets of berries. And who eats them all in fastest time wins something. <laughs> Number one spot for friendship of Sorlier. There you go. Oh my I get <laughs> favorite of Sorlier. Aww. But but I could impress you. I choose we pockets. could impress you. Pockets! I did tell you guys not to win this, the heart of Surly over us, over me. <laughs> oh, betrayed. Can you Again. believe her? She's so dang adorable. <laughs> no, not at all. I really spent my whole time with them today. Mm. Pockets and Stucker uh, and, and uh, Almond too. It was fun today, but a guard then tried to talk to, to them. They were um, suspicious, and so I had to hiss at them to get them off of the frallies. Mm. Mm. That's probably for the best. Yeah, they seem suspicious, and then and then I can't believe that a guard asked them to... I mean, I don't... My guards didn't really help me through my... But whatever. What I'm saying is... I can't believe that then they tried to make them do stuff for them. Like, they wanted them to spy on some of the Rosewood students. Well, that was mm. foolish. Even as a cus, Yeah, even as a custom, mm. that is... Yeah. Yeah, so... If he's, he's that's going why by I knowing growled. the customs, then he's going out of line. Mm. Anyone's customs, I think what you did really. was right. If a Ferrari is owned mm. by someone, then that Ferrari is meant to be loyal to them. 
Someone asking to spy oh. on their own <laughs> is not a wise move. The Ferali could simply report it. Now the guard has I never some trouble. Apologize then. I, I said something mean while I was telling the, the guard. I I I'm sorry, no. uh I called you guys just slaves, but you should have obeyed to orders from me. But you really don't have to if you don't want to. Okay? I never got to apologize to Ominous Tucker either. <laughs> I'm glad you understand that then. I think I did hurt the feelings of Almond saying that though. Hmm. Well, I will be able to apologize eventually. Uh, but I, I didn't find. Uh, there was no. Um, uh, th there was. Uh, I didn't find Jacqueline. We did. Mm -hmm. And did you ask for me? No. Oh, okay. Yeah, that, that's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll ask. Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll ask um, Do they, Maybe they're still around, maybe I'll uh, find them later and ask them if I can sleep on the bunker. If not, I'll just, uh, I'll, I'll be fine. We have a good spot, if not, right? Right? Very good spot, very, very su super cool spot, if mm -hmm. they don't allow me to sleep with you guys. Where's that? Oh, something good. Oh, couch! Yes, the couch! The couch that is uh, somewhere in the ship. I don't remember where because I can't really read and I keep on getting lost. But the, the, the couch! In the training ground. So. Mm hmm. As long as That's you're the last option. Yep. I mean, the metal. It's not that. Bad. <laughs> Whatever. Um. There are plenty of beds. So anyways. But I don't want plenty of beds anywhere. I want pe plenty of beds near you. And you know. Look at me. I am. Be apparently, according to many, actually, I'm just a long frolly, which is fine. <laughs> every day, every day I've been called a frolly by different people, which is fine. Uh, what I'm trying to say is, you know what? I could basically sleep anywhere. <laughs> I know I'm very so different cute. from you guys, and sometimes I have a little bit of doubts over that. I mean, how different could my world be from yours? But... I mean, I guess you guys have... I, I heard someone said skill issues. You guys have skill issues towards that. I can sleep wherever I want and I'm gonna be fine. Whatever makes you happy. Yeah, it makes me happy to have at least one skill a little better than you guys. You seem to be cool in everything. You're amazing fighters. I mean, I've seen you guys fight as a rift beast when I was hiding and... It... <laughs> but <laughs> It's true! Besides, I don't think gathering is really a skill. We, we shall find my place here. It's it's alright. Maybe you could come out with me. I'm looking for herbs for, uh... What's his name? Robert. For alchemy. Oh, oh okay. I, I, for a moment, I thought you were... <laughs> Okay, when you pause to think about Robert's name, I thought you meant I'm looking for herbs for, um, um, you know, like I've seen people in Droza look for herbs, but they use them in a recreational manner. I just say, never mind. Yeah, I'll help you find the herbs. I'll help you find the herbs. You're not gonna, like, do anything with them, so. Yeah, it's like, no, I don't, I don't do alchemy things. Last time I oh, did alchemy, I almost killed a professor. It was pretty huh? great. You what? What did you do? He asked us to make something using whatever ingredients we could find, I think. And it didn't go well. At all. 
Well, depends on what your what happened. Depending on what your <laughs> la, your last goal is, you see, if it was to kill someone and create a surprise attack that meant an accident, that would have been successful. But it wasn't, so yeah. I mean, I mean, maybe now now you know. Do you remember the recipe? Now you know how to make it look like an accident. If you wanna, yeah. It was pomegranate juice oh. and pepper flakes and butterfly wings. Oh, did it make like a? No, but it smelled good. Oh, oh, okay. And was it like a poison? It wasn't supposed to be. I don't remember what it was supposed to be. Oh. I only remember that he almost died. And that Gallop was there. Oh, okay. That's interesting. Alright. Thank you for dinner. Quest. What? What? You said thank you. You said it in a way I wasn't sure. <coughs> mm. <coughs> you can let it out. I am. <laughs> so earlier, I'm about to tell you something. I, this is a this is a very uncomfortable uh, position for you to be in because you see, maybe next time you sit this way and I sit that way at your right side because I um I'm going. To yeah. Push you off the bench. <laughs> well, but, but, but I'm right. Obviously I don't understand right. why you consistently point out my wounds. No, I'm just saying. It would be easy for you. I'm gonna help you. <laughs> if you find Jacqueline, knock on the door. But I am going to bed. Oh, I will too. Oh, uh, all right. Hi, well then, uh, good night. Hi. You gotta. Have a little beauty sleep. Certainly do our oh, best sleeping in this iron machine. Mm, yeah, I'm still not used to it. <laughs> and honestly, I prefer grass. I don't have boots, I don't have shoes. It's cold, my beans. <laughs> my beans. But I'm done complaining about it. <laughs> Here you go, Armin. Fine, Jackal. Oh, yes, I'm sure she's still up and around. Oh, but... yes, I need to find Jacqueline then. Come on. <laughs> Hi, Almond. <laughs> okay, hopefully this one doesn't get dropped. There you go. Hates <laughs> you. Have of course. Wedding to bed. Uh, Almond, mm. Almond, Almond, my friend. Maybe take off the mask. Don't, don't. <laughs> take off the mask. We need. I need to move her things and my things. Guys, I have a... Hope to see you tomorrow in the morning! Mm. It will be hard Good to night. miss you. I mean, I'm no, that's what I meant. I meant it will be hard to miss you, like not see you. I will miss you a lot, actually. You have no idea. But, uh, you have a good <laughs> night, man. <laughs> you as well. <laughs> yes, I'll be, I'll be very close, trust me. <laughs> like you may be able to hear me breathe through the walls. <laughs> because I'm sorry, I kind of lied to you. It's not really the couch, my first option. It is actually... Well, you see this perfect spot right here. You may be able to, br to hear me breathe through the wall. <laughs> um, it's fine. Well, if you find Jacqueline, that won't be an issue. Okay, good. So go find her. Before she goes I to bed. I do have to find Jacqueline. I'm sorry. Good, good night to you both. It's just so hard to let go. Um, yes. Um, good night. Good night. Mm. Where are we goes? We have to find Jacqueline to get uh, access to this beautiful door with the blue sand. Jacqueline's sword.
It's already begun. <clears throat> yep, we're gonna have company. That's not what I meant. To be honest, what? I've already started the pomegranate collection. Oh. <laughs> and that. I don't know how you're gonna roll onto me with that guard there. Oh, I'm a terrible sleeper. You're just gonna catapult over the edge. Yeah. Suit so yourself. Good night, Sylvia.